Hello, happy savers. We are doing, uh, we're going to do a cash stuffing, my wallet, today. But not necessarily, <laughs> not necessarily an unstuffing because I overspent. Matter of fact, I overspent so much that I had to dip into this coming week's money. Um, oops. <laughs> so it's just, you know, sometimes things happen. As a matter of fact, I already know I forgot to put in a receipt because we wound up doing trunk or treating with the motorcycles uh, yesterday. And I had to go and buy two of the large bags of candy. So what was yesterday? Yesterday was the 28th. Okay, so $49. I'll just put candy. Um, let's see, what else did I do? Today, I was supposed to spend money, but I wound up not spending any money because um, I got halfway down the road, down the highway, and my truck decided to start shaking and lose all power. So I guess I do have a little budget helper. So it's just in the name of my Ford truck. Yeah, but tomorrow we will call the dealership, find out what happened, and um, pray that it's going to be covered under the warranty. Okay, so I'm not going to count those so's because it's kind of my stalling tactic. Okay, so here's my wallet. Um, the grocery money that I have in here is going to get wrapped back up into next week's because I took, I think, a hundred bucks out of there. And, um, yeah, I spent some of it because <laughs> I only had a couple of bucks left in here. So we will see how much I took out of there. And how much I have to put back. And then I also wound up spending money on something else that I don't remember because I didn't write it all down. Oh, we had the neighbor dinner. Oh, and then I had to go to Menards because after the whole Naked Man story, we had another incident with just, you know, people looking in sheds and stuff like that. Luckily, they didn't take anything but there was definitely evidence that it was not there. So we went out and bought more cameras and more motion sensor lights. So basically our neighborhood looks like a grand theater. <laughs> it's supposed to just use caution if you drive into our street because it's going to light your entire way with all these 3,000 to 6,000 lumen um, motion lights. <laughs> so just proceed with caution. Okay, so let's see. We're going to have, let's start back here. For my personal funds, we have 20 bucks. And this is only going to be a half a week anyway because I get paid on Wednesday. So I'm going to be doing this all over again anyway. Uh, we've got $40 for dining out. But the nice thing about it is this money, whatever is left over here on Wednesday, will go into my... Um, my savings challenge fund so I can play some games on Wednesday. All right, we've got $60 for fuel, which, you know, I might not need if my truck's not working. And then for groceries, we have 20, and then we also have 20, 30, 40, 45, 50, 51, 52, 53, 54, 55, 56, 57, 58, 59, 60, 61, 62, 63, 64, 65, 66. So we have $66 left over. So that means I had a couple of bucks left over to help out with all that candy. But so we have $86 total for groceries, which is going to be just fine, especially for the next couple of days. And then we have my change. I have a lot of change. As a matter of fact, I had so much change this week that I had to put some of it into the piggy bank so that I could close my wallet. Okay, we will try and make quick work of this. So I am going to sort this out, count it up, and 
I'm going to fast forward you through it. Okay, now we're coming back so that we can figure out where I need to put all this money. Okay, I need $4.79. So we have one, two, three, four. And then we've got 25, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 76, whoops. 77, 78, 79. Okay, and then we need, I don't think we're going to get 478, but we've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38. $4.38. Cents. Okay, I'm going to put this into my coin jar thing separator and I will fast forward through it. So I'll see you back here in just a minute. That is done. We need to add those in. Give me just a second. I need to add this up. Okay. I think my math is right. I will have to double check it when I'm done here. Because I didn't bring my calculator over here with me. You know what? Power of television, I'll be right back. I'm going to go grab my calculator. Okay, let's see if I added that up right. Okay, I was a dollar off. Donkeys. But we are up to $133 just by saving our coins. And when did we start? Oh, yeah, we started in May. So not bad, 133 bucks. Okay, I think that is going to do it. I am going to see if I can get my computer to restart again. And um, then I'm going to start making some of my A6 challenges into the A5 size. So if you're an A5 challenge user, uh, give me a minute and you'll start seeing them up on my Etsy page. Otherwise, thank you so much for stopping by. Uh, tomorrow I'm very excited because I get uh, an Etsy paycheck, which is always very exciting. Usually I don't even get to see it because it either gets eaten up with fees <laughs> or um, it just goes straight into savings. But now I, I finally, I think I breached $75. <laughs> so I'm very excited about it. So we're going to play with some of that money on game night for Wednesday night. Okay, that's going to be it for me. Um, yeah, thanks. Thanks again for stopping by. Take care.